hey diamonds welcome back so what you are looking at right now is my new Zuka bag um, this is the kit I was using before and I still use it from time to time but I needed something that was just gonna be a little more easier to use to carry um, so I consolidated everything into this Zuka bag now depending on the job that I do I will interchange products from here to there so this will definitely still be to store and house most of the stuff um, between jobs so let's just get right into it this is the Zuka Sport Zuka <laughs> Zuka Sport where you can choose the um you can choose the the insert that you want and you can also choose the frame that you want but of course they did not have a purple frame so I chose this kind of ocean baby bluish color because I like color and it also has the um the wheels that light up as they roll I believe the bottom wheel lights up as it rolls yeah it's the bottom wheel so on the side here on both sides actually it has this mesh pocket it has a deep pocket in here that you could put stuff in and then it also has this pocket up here which is pretty good for like business cards mints or gum or even your keys or something like that and like I said it has the same over here and this is the side that I actually use so up here I have my business cards and then in here I have um, snacks for me which is really um, just you know my fiber one <laughs> bars and uh, you know I keep a bottle of water on this side so the top part is the steel part and you can sit on it or my client can sit on it then it has the handle here which comes up and then it also goes higher you've got the front part which says suka in purple yay so this part clips comes up and it's a full zipper around Let's get that open and as you can see it's quite full <laughs> I filled it up like I filled it up everything in here ex except a slice of bread so on the side you have two pockets which are I think are currently empty yeah these two are empty and I also have a zipper pocket over here which I am careful to open because I put products in here that I don't want to necessarily lay down so I have like my fix plus my model in a bottle um, my hand sanitizer, my makeup remover, and my because, yeah, my MAC moisturizer. Just because I don't want those products to lay down or anything like that. So I just stick them in there and I keep this part zipped up. So because I know what's in there, I know just to be careful when opening that up. So getting right in here is right on top is my brush belt which we'll put there and I'll show that at the end of the video um, so in here it's just um, a random clear plastic bag and in here I have all of my disposables and tools so I've got the pointy and q-tips I've got um, mascara wands there are some doe foot wands in there some lip brushes some disposable spatulas um, a pencil sharpener and then my metal tools, which are a nail clipper, just in case, eyelash curler, hair clips, um, scissors, tweezers, and a metal. It's actually a, a for nails, but I use it as a spatula. This thing right here, I use it as a spatula. I've got two of those in there. Now, on these cases, as you can see, you can actually label them. I have not because I'm not sure if what's in there right now is necessarily going to be in there for the next job I do. So, I just leave them blank and I repack as I go for each job that I have to do. So, let's get this one out. Oh, and the cool thing, it has this little hook, so I keep my keys hooked on there. So, this one... I can get it out. 
has my baby wipes. It has um, my gel liners in here, sponges. It has my uh, puffs in the back, my beauty blenders right there. And then the pink bottle you see there, that's uh, water. And this purple one right here is brush cleaner. And under the baby wipes, I have um, paper towels. Oh, what was that? Okay. <laughs> the next one in here is kind of a hodgepodge of stuff. So I've got bronzers underneath. I have my MAC foundations. And then I have my Mary Kay foundations. Then I have my Makeup Forever Flash Palette. These three things you see right there, those are um, black opal stick foundations that I deep potted. I have a video showing that. Um, here are Ziploc. This is a black bag with all my MAC concealers. This bag over here has mascara and lash glue. And back here, I don't know if you can see that, it has the um, all my eye pencils are in the back there. And then over here, I have um, eye primers and then brow stuff. So I have brow gel. I have two different um, brow powders. I think one is from Milani. Um, and then I have Duo Lash Glue. Is it Duo Lash Glue? No, that's over there. What else is in here? Oh, I have my MAC brow pencils in there. It's just a Mark bronzer and a Tarte bronzer so next up is this which i have all of my pigments in so that just in case it's a color i'm looking for and it's not in a palette or the palette just isn't working for me glitters over here which you're not necessarily going to use all the time depending on the jobs that you do take but i like to have it just in case and then the rest of these are all just pigments uh jesse's girl mac Coastal Scents, um, I think that's it, Jessie's Girl, MAC, Coastal Scents, oh, NYX, and I think The Body Needs as well is in here. Then I just label them pigments, love my label maker. Next up, um, another snack, just in case, just some sugar to keep me going, some Skittles. Then in the next container has my Ben Nye foundation. Under that is another palette, just another box, just like the pigments, except it holds all my lipsticks. So it's holding um, NYX lipsticks, MAC lipsticks, um, Wet n Wild, NYC. Um, I think that's it. And then over here I have lip stuff like lip conditioner lip glosses and then here i have face primers and i believe that's it in there yeah just uh face primers I have the body shop i believe it is and uh what is that one for the poreless one poreless i think i want to say it's benefit it's just a sample though and finally i have a mirror which needs to be cleaned. And then this one holds all of my palettes. So it's the heaviest, so I keep it on the bottom. So this has my eyeshadow palettes, my blush palettes, and one lip palette from Coastal Scents. And then I keep a pen. Always keep a pen. So, excuse me. That is it for what I keep in my Zuka. And before I move on because just in case someone asks for me to show it I'm gonna show you my brush belt so that I don't have to show the video just on the brush belt so this is my brush belt which I got from Sigma and I've got a number of brushes in here Mac um, Sigma Elf Japanesque Sedona lace from makeup by Ren Ren I have her brushes, um, Coastal Scents, and NYX as well. So those are all the brushes that I carry. I actually have a few more that are drying because I just cleaned them. And I'm going to put them in here because I have a job to do tomorrow. And 
I like to make sure I have enough brushes for everybody. So this is my brush belt. And again, the brands I carry are Sigma, MAC, Sedona Lace, Coastal Sense, Elf, and Japonesque. Oh, Japonesque. Japonesque. Anywho, love you all, Diamonds. I hope you have a wonderful day, and thanks for watching. Bye. Oh, and if you have any questions about anything you've seen in here, so if you actually want me to take the products out and show you, um, or if you want a question about anything specific, just, you know, comment down below. Love you all. Bye.